welcome back, members of the Wolf Pack. It's your boy. <clears throat> back with another episode of Rise of Ronin. Went on a little vacation, so right now I'm away from my original setup. What would so it I'm, be? So I might sound a little different and whatnot, but we're, we're gonna get into this. We can do. We can do Please, what we got. Come again. Uh, we we ended off with the first part of the. Uh, a show for the Shogun, Shogun uh, quest. We beat all those guys in a fight, and now we're on the second part of it, I believe. Mm. Uh, the quest kind of like changed on it. It was looking ahead, then it kind of changed to what it is now, which is, bro, you can try to walk through me like that, and then it stir me down. Mm. That's funny that that happened though, because uh, <clears throat> sometimes Japanese people do try to do that, try to walk through you, which is crazy because the average height of most people I'm running to is like five five, and I'm six foot, so and two hundred and something pounds, and mostly most of them are like a, a buck twenty if at, at the max, and sometimes they'll try to walk right through you. Especially, it's, it's usually the women. The guys is like is whatever. Was stuff, and it's not. It's usually like the women, especially the older women, because there's a big respect for <clears throat> the elderly. That everybody just assumes you're gonna move out of their way. And, that, and that's not always the case. And I, it's, it's not something I, I don't ever try to be rude about it at, at all. But when the most time when like if, if I'm not moving, it's because they're directly walking into my path of walking for no reason. Like there's there's a there's a clear other path that they could take, but instead they want to keep walking straight towards me. You know, it's almost like like cars on the road. Just imagine imagine you're in the right lane and our car gets into the right lane with you. And it's driving straight head on to you, and they're not moving over to the lane of death. Their side of the right lane is, is is basically what it is. And it's like, what what are you doing? It's like I'm coming down the stairs all the way to the right, and you're walking up the stairs all the way to what, what, what would be your left for no reason. When there's clearly a path to the right that you can walk up to, but you're not even going to to attend or attempt to go to it. You just want to keep walking through me, and you expect me to move out of the way. It's what I'm happening. I'm like, what the what the hell are we doing? Anyways, let's get into this question. I don't know what the hell. I don't know why I decided to go rambling like that for. Well, well, <clears throat> you really are something, aren't you? I can't believe you managed to win against His Excellency. Well, that's right. The last dude we fought was the Shogun. I ain't even. I forgot about that. Spit a little jokes. Stop kidding around. You must have felt it when you met him. We can't afford to lose a great man like that. Feel free to make use of this place from now on. You need to hold this place for us. Well, I guess we probably unlock the fighting ring or something like that. Do you really intend to obey the Imperial Court's order and go to Kyoto? This is a fine opportunity. Kyoto is where we can find those who wish to topple me and put the Imperial Court in my place. So, let's get on the front foot and bring this conflict to an end. You didn't think I meant to go unprepared, did you? Tadamori! Sir. As military commissioner of Kyoto, you will go as my advance guard. You may take your pick of my finest warriors. Your Excellency, allow me to gather an army to defend Kyoto. I shall find you truly worthy soldiers from all levels of society. This is madness! You'll attract scoundrels! You'll open the door to traitors! Let them come. We shall deal with them all in one fell swoop. I leave this to you. My lord, now if you will excuse me. <laughs> I guess they're trying to weed us out, the anti-Shogunite folks out. Yeah, that was definitely the quest. So, I probably def that last video, I definitely should have uh, uh, popped that in there, and I didn't. Hey!
I'm gonna go silent a lot because freaking uh, I'm coughing up a storm over here. See, now it's back to looking ahead. The quest is back to looking ahead. So let me check something. So we got a bunch of stuff unlocked. See, I, I knew it. There's a bunch of side quests and stuff now. And I was gonna knock out all these side quests off camera because I, I I know there's probably a couple of them. Yeah, see, now we got, we got, we got one with the Shogun Knight, too. What's the main quest? Talk to Ryoma. All right, we're not going to talk to... There's, there's, there's three of them. There's three side quests, and I don't want to skip any of these. All right, so this is going to wind up being a side quest uh, video. What that last one was. Let's go ahead and take care of this one first, since it's the closest one to us. And then we'll take care of the other two, and that'll be this, this video. That's what this video will be about. <coughs> And that's the, th the, the kind of difficult thing about making these, excuse making these videos, like, without using a capture card and stuff, is that I'm making these videos raw from Twitch, and then immediately importing them to, uh, what's it called, um, YouTube, because you can export your videos straight from Twitch to YouTube. So that's pretty much what I'm doing, so that they're just raw. If I was using a capture card, I would capture these videos. I'm basically playing a game like I'm playing right now, but it wouldn't be streaming live. I would capture these videos and then edit them, like just cutting out all the all the uh, the uh, fruitless stuff, and then I would they, they would I would put them on YouTube, or I could still stream them on Twitch, just like this, capture them still, and then edit them. <clears throat> no, I'm not I'm not gonna worry about him. Now I was looking up some. Oh, hold on, got a cough. I was looking up some stuff, and I can, you do have the, the ability on Twitch to download the videos. So I could just, it's better to use your capture card, because your capture card captures whatever quality it is. Like, if I'm playing on a 4K TV, my capture card is going to capture the video in 4K. But Twitch only captures up to 1080p. So it, it will only display your videos up to 1080p. So if I download the video from Twitch... It's only gonna be at a 1080p quality, so it won't be at a higher quality if I if I don't use a capture card. Over here. These two fools fought me. These two dudes are strong too, fighting against them both at the same time. Someone. Can I trust you not to get in our way? Word is a renowned martial arts master is training on this mountain. So we've come to hone our skills. I'd really like to get to Takasuki's level one day. My word, can you not go two minutes without mentioning that man's name? You don't want to talk? You're constantly going, Kusaka this, Kusaka that. Moving on. You hammered us good and proper at Ine's place. We're painfully aware of our need to grow if we're to achieve anything. <coughs> okay. What are talking about? Let's see. It's also the dialogue. We wanted to have Dr. Ine show us how to make the poison. It would have made a fine arrow in our quiver against the Shogunate. See, that's why they can't, like, that's, that's the thing, man. Like, this, this just reminds me of, like, all types of research and stuff. Like, <clears throat> most of every drug, not every single one, but a, a good amount of drugs that are drugs today were <clears throat> created their initial purpose were created to help people, but then they got abused and became drugs. Sorry to disappoint you, but we were working alone. But that's we that's kind of like this medicine, like to bolster his somewhat. Somebody's trying to create a miracle drug, and y'all trying to use it since since it can be so, so closely related to poison. Y'all trying hey, to use it I as poison. The martial arts master we're after competed in the tournament at the military academy, didn't? You compete too? Sure did, and won it. If you're already acquainted, would you ask him to let us train with him? Oh, I ain't got a trace, but oh, yeah, I'll do it. Thank you. Much obliged. So now it's probably about to take me somewhere else. Okay. Lie and wait for the. Oh, it's the, it's the little dude. Over there. Is that him? 
Mm-hmm. He looks kind of young. Yeah, it was the jiu-jitsu dude. He was, he was, the, he was the youngest dude. You there? Dang, they just popped out on him. I'll fight him. You're not Jigoro Kano, are you? Yes? Can I help you? Oh, ah, I, I remember you from the military academy. Why am I sound like I don't know who he is? I don't know if I'll go quite so far. <clears throat> Though I suppose I've received a fair bit of attention since then. And we're acquaintances too. I wonder, would you be so kind as to teach us to fight? You want me to teach you? Hmm. I've had some nasty rumors about Choshu of late, and as a member of the military academy, my hands might be tied. Very well. After all, you did go out of your way to find me. I suppose we could run through a few training exercises. Wonderful. We're very much looking forward to it. There's a place up ahead Alfred used to train. <clears throat> Let's go over there now. This is where I practice my hill sprints, where I run full steam from the base all the way to the top. By using often neglected muscle groups, I strengthen not only my legs, but my entire body. Naturally, it also helps to build stamina. I don't know. This sounds rather basic. Yeah, let's make it interesting. What if we race to see who can reach the top first? <clears throat> I don't care about none of this. Of course not. I'm deadly serious about this. Master Kano, give us the signal. Very well. But remember, this is training. Do I have to beat these fools when the race Ready? Go! I've got this! I can perfectly hold my own here. should stand back. It's you, Yamagata. <clears throat> well, I cheated like crazy, too. That was mad well cheating. Well done. I need... All right, then. Let's move on to the next exercise. This is where face off one on one with another as if you were engaging in a real combat. What technique you choose is entirely up to you. I see. Got any <coughs> tips before we begin? The success of your training depends on you and your partner. That is, you must approach your fight with a willingness to help each other succeed. I really don't feel like Got fighting it. these fools. I hate Master fighting Kano, them. They're, they're actually pretty hard. It'd be my hard. honor to train with someone of your caliber. Oh, I expect me, you'd be yeah, able to wipe the heart. floor with me. Would you not? Yes. Well, I'm afraid you're not quite at my level. But perhaps the three of you could try and take me on together. What? The nerve of this guy! We'll make you eat those words! Come on, Ito! Let's get him! The three of us can take him down! <clears throat> Man, don't drag me into this. He straight up said, I'll be, I'll be, I'll clap all y'all. Remember, I'll beat him by myself. So. Oh, y'all using this. You're fooling yourself if you think you're the best of the three of us! <clears throat> Crying afterwards. Oh, oh, oh. Get me. Come on now, y'all get some of him. Oh, he got me. Oh, judo. His, 
attacks are so long. Rank, rank. Oh, I thought I reversed that. That's not jujitsu. It is as well. I feel, like, I feel like he's doing more judo than anything. I get that shit out of here. I would really appreciate it if y'all if y'all did some hits on him. Yeah, there you go. See, easy. Now he's about to die. Perhaps one against three was a bit ambitious. Maybe, maybe just a bit ambitious, my boy. I'm trying to be like you, my boy. How much? One man made made a struggle. Made y'all struggle. Nigga, I'm good. I underestimated him. I suppose that's what you get from a famous martial artist. If we keep training like that, do you think we could get that strong? I suppose. Shall we get back to it then? I should thank you too. I appreciate you vouching for us. You're fairly generous yourself, the way I see it. We're going to get stronger. Just you wait. <coughs> Strong enough to pay back what we owe you one day. All right. Oh, we just now got the bond with him. All right, cool. See, the thing about that is getting that bond with him. He uses hand to hand. Like, what, what is he gonna improve? I think I think I can actually check. I never really check these things, these bonds and stuff, but I think it should tell me what I'm gonna unlock. Cause that's another dude that uses hand to hand too. Let me find this big old guy that uses hand to hand this dude so it just gives you strength he's a strength plus one when he when he's uh when we're inseparable inseparable and then strength plus one again when we fade it so he, do, he doesn't do anything else like it doesn't it doesn't give me like plus on my styles or anything like that so it's probably the same thing for him yeah dexterity all right so would I think, I think that full toss is not even a technique. I think that's a, uh, uh I can't use it. I was, I try, I try to go and look at it, but I think that's just a, um, uh, what's that thing called? A emo. All right. That's one down. <clears throat> what was the other two? I think I still got to go over here and do some stuff. Oh no, I got it already. Which one of these areas have I not cleared? There's, a, there's definitely an area I haven't gotten a hundred percent at yet. So this is 100%, but it's not 100%. It's only bond level 2 instead of bond level 3. Which is crap. Oh, let me next it out. It has to be this area. Yeah, it's 56%. And this is 94%. Uh, it's because it is... I don't know. I keep going over there. That treasure chest is not there. I have no idea where that chest is at. Alright, anyways. Let's go ahead to him. Let's knock out his quest. And then we'll knock out this quest. And we'll be, we'll be done with those quests. Quest. Pillar of Edo. Edo. Should take this opportunity to level up, level up everybody's stuff too. But I, I don't think it's a trophy. <clears throat> I don't think I need a trophy hey. to level up everybody's stuff. I, I only need to level up one dude's stuff to the max, and it was fine. Oh. But there, there is a trophy to unlock all of the stats. I don't know if I'm a platinum trophy this game though. Tatsugoro's in something of a bind, you see. There's a shogunate man causing trouble for him. Yeah, who the hell is Tatsunago? Tatsugoro. Surely you remember. 
He's the leader of the firefighters. You borrowed some men from him on our behalf. Uh huh. Well, given my position, I can't exactly be seen to intervene. Yeah, I got. I still have to play Star Wars Outlaw. Why don't you start by getting the full story from the actual mission? Song Wukong, and um, and now in October. Dragon Age comes out, and I'm a huge Dragon Age fan. It's one of my favorite series of games, so I'll probably wind up playing that before I plan, wind up playing any other any of the other ones. Because I, I still want to finish this, because I don't want to leave the series unfinished. So I want to finish this, and then I'll probably start Dragon Age, and then I'll probably start Wukong and whatnot. But I don't know what comes out after Dragon Age. It's probably going to try to take my attention, too. But <clears throat> the main thing is finishing this first. I promise you will be duly compensated for this. You'll find him at the lumberyard in Fukugawa. All right, 1,600 600 meters a mile? Yeah, 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 it is. Because half a mile is 880 meters. So 1,600 meters is a mile. All right. But yeah... Like I said, there's a there's a trophy. Oh, that guy, the mighty warrior dude. That's who it is. There's a trophy to unlock all of these. And so there's a trophy to unlock all of them on one, and I think there's a trophy to unlock all of them on all of them. I, don't quote me on it though, because I literally cannot remember. Like I I think, but I don't remember. We can get this up. I thought I was finished. Let's finish this one out. Let's get this up. Now we have just a little bit more. These things are all kind of annoying because they cost so many points to get up and whatnot. Like, none of these am I, am I, am I even really close to figuring to, to, to finishing other than, oh, I got a lot of int points. I didn't even know I had that many, this many intelligent points. If I had this many intelligent points, I might be able to max out something. Let's max out this. The headshot one is not going to be finished. I can max out this. So now I got three points left. That, that's crazy how all those points just went. I had 12 points and they all just gone like that. So I still got to use some points for this one. There's going to be eight points that I'm going to need for that. And then uh, that's 8, 10, 16. 27. Dang, that's me a lot of points, bro. Like, that's crazy. But you get a points from other people's bonds. That's why you got to do everybody's bonds and stuff like that. Because you get points from from the bonds and from, like, the territories. Mm -hmm. and there's still one more ah, chapter of this game to go. His Lordship Katsu sent you, did he? I take it you're up to speed. The new man from the Shogunate is a real piece of work. He's conspired with the supplier to hike up the price of lumber. Now, all the carpenters in town are worried they won't be able to work. As a firefighter, I can't let this go unchecked. When the house burns down, my job isn't over till it's been rebuilt. If only I can smack some sense into those boys. But we can't be seen doing that. No, this job requires subtlety. And besides, all my strapping young men are in Katsu's care now. Of course, if you would lend us your skills, we could get this done in no time. I guess I ain't really got a choice. <sighs> I didn't I know there was a choice before one. I picked it. And I'm sure I, was, I was just saying it out loud. I guess I ain't got a choice. Himself about now. You know, way back when, he get into fights at the drop of a hat. His father had a nasty temper too. Suppose the apple doesn't fall far from the tree. Ah, but his lordship has his title to worry about now. He can't just do as he pleases anymore. Anyway, our government man is supposedly conducting some furtive talks close by. Can you go right away? I guess. 
Thanks. I know you can handle yourself, but please be careful. Did any of y'all read uh, Manhua? Manhua, however you want to say it. Uh, I read a good bit of Manhua. And if y'all have some recommendations, y'all can drop those below. Drop them in the thing and I'll and I hit them up. Alright. Defeat the formidable foes. Straight up, just giving niggas hands. That's a formidable foe right there. That's a formidable foe for sure. How do I get up here? Oh, I can get up here right here. Oh my gosh, I didn't even see this dude up here. Hey, bro. Yeah, go ahead and uh, take a seat for me right quick. Yeah, I knew you was a formidable foe. I knew you was. <laughs> uh, God, good little stabby stab. And, oh, what? I think he rolled, he fell, he jumped in, he, man, he, he, uh, rolled into it right as it was, uh, right as I was grabbing it. Yeah, now. Oh, come here, bro. Why didn't I sprint? You messed up your own stamina. Got yourself killed. business and then look, look up. that's crazy bro can't even fish in peace oh my bad bro my bad my bad my bad my bad I ain't, I ain't know you was over there chilling my bad bro nah you don't see nothing you don't see nothing oh never mind you did see something did you? Yeah, you seen it. <laughs> Dang, you can't swim. That's cold, bro. I would never want to go out like that. I can't swim that well either, so I know what it feels like. I almost drowned before twice. I know that jank sucks, bro. Dang, you got your throat sliced. That's crazy. I didn't know he was up there. But I know now. Dang, bro. Dang. That's a little, that's a little crazy. Y'all getting killed like that mercilessly. You don't even know what's coming. Dang, you should've been looking out for your boy. You wasn't even looking out for your partner. Now both of y'all did. Come here, you. Come down here. Dang, man, that's crazy, 
bro. <laughs> I ain't. I bird on your ass, bro. I bird on you. Bird it on YouTube, niggas. Bird it on YouTube, bro. And about to get your boys. And about to get your boys over there. Watch me, watch me, watch me, watch me, watch me, watch me, watch me. Huh. One. Huh. Two. I can't get him because. Huh, huh. Wait, hold on. Huh. Get that shit out of here, bro. Damn. Dead. Look at you. <laughs> Choke on your own blood. Hell of a way to go out. What's up? Hey! Hmm, I'm gonna kill you and your mans. And your mans. Oh wow, the double poke is crazy. I've never seen them do that before. The double poke is wow. I had to make sure he knew that this was going back to him and his ancestors. Come here, quick. Mm. Oh, uh, oh, why am I being so brutal right now? What is going on? Who do I hate? Who did this? Oh no, nah, y'all about to get it. Y'all about to get it. flown on. Oh, you got so lucky. You got so lucky. I landed. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you got so lucky. I landed on top of that dang uh, stack right there. If I went land on top of that stack, you'd have been. Oh yeah, you did, bro. Yeah, you, you just, this is a series of unfortunate events, bro. You, you just got limited snickets. Neither one of y'all the big bad guy? That's crazy. Your boy ain't looking snickets. Huh. It's a series of unfortunate events, bro. You're limited snickets. Or whatever the name of that name, the name of that daggone thing is. Jiminy Cricket. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, where's the last formidable guy at? I know you know his name. I, oh, right when he was about to turn around. You was just about to turn around. You almost quit me. He must be over here somewhere. Huh, can I fly across there and jump up there? That's probably somebody on the, he is on the bridge. But there's probably somebody on the bridge. But they made this like this. They, they, they made that too easy to get across like that. So I knew there had to be something over there. Something stopping me, or something about to be in my way. He's smoking, so his stamina already down. I'll get your stamina back. Stop on me right now. Yes, sir. Alright. Let's go ahead and complete this quest now. What are you doing here? Bro! Man, that nigga no, run. Your you fat ass should have made it run that fast. I mean, that far. Okay, stop. I'm trying to do something. Stop! I said stop. I didn't know you was going to be that weak. Something, Something's up. You, should, you shouldn't have never been that weak. That was crazy weak. I'm sorry. I'm begging you. Spare my life. You're letting me go. Run! Let's get out of here. I think if I was uh like a Ronin or something like that, or in these times, I would probably let the people go too. 
but it, it'll be more on a sense of like now you work for me like i i would not be that good of that that much of a guy i don't know if y'all seen uh uh tony stachovici the english way is to be i think it's stavachi is the albanian way or something like that but i don't know if y'all seen one of his videos he was talking about a, a zombie uh, apocalypse video the design pocket is what happened as he talks to his boys like hey we survived another day y'all we did good and then it shows um a pregnant lady like he's pretending to be a pregnant lady and they're like oh hell no nah. get out of here this is this and like what y'all not gonna hit him he's like fuck no nah, i'm gonna protect you he's like when you do this is this is going on basically going on about it like you protect yourself because people in, in these shows there's always some pregnant chick that's in the zombie apocalypse knowing good and well the thing that's gonna get you killed is her not being able to move properly or when the baby's born, the baby crying and giving away your position and stuff. So it's like there is so much negative to having a baby, old ladies, disabled kids and stuff in a zombie apocalypse with you in your group. There's so much negativity to it. Like, is it the right thing to do to try to save them? Sure. Is it the smart thing to do? Absolutely not. You're making your whole life a lot harder. And depending on what type of zombies you have coming at you, it's going to be crazy. So for me, I would be accepting a bunch of people like that's doing some stuff like hey now you work for me your whole oh, business is shit. shut down like you see me beat the crap out of all your people so if you want your business back and you now work for me like now i get a cut i get 30 percent but it seems you didn't leave any work for him nonsense i knew our friend here would take care of everything i can't be drawing my sword over every petty squabble now can i thanks for taking care of this so did you find the evidence we were looking for? Sure. I knew I could rely on you. He won't be able to talk his way out with this evidence. I'll take it from here. <coughs> what are you saying? He doesn't deserve to die for what he did. Besides, I have a few questions I want to ask him. I'm glad you didn't finish the job, so to speak. And have a little extra on me for a task well done. Now the carpenters should be able to get back to work. Just you wait. They'll have those burnt down houses rebuilt in no time. Ah, that's good to hear. I can't bear seeing my beloved hometown in this state. Right. It's time I got going. Don't worry, though. I have plenty more work for you. Alright, that's number two done. One more. Let me make sure another one didn't unlock somewhere. I usually go to mission, it's a lot easier. Alright, Twilight Raid, this is the Shogun. So, that, so this quest is probably going to up, up to my... Uh, faction with the shogun stuff let me see if i got any better weapons and stuff like I, I really still don't know what to use for my secondary weapon because i love this ox uh blades oxtail blade so much because it's so quick so it lets it lets me get attacks off like exactly how i need to okay so we got another a new piece of equipment that's mighty warrior as well it's only a plush tree huh i don't really care about putting up a plush tree Nothing new here that I need to put on. Nothing new there. I don't like the uh, red dots on my stuff. All right, let's go ahead and teleport towards that quest. And let's do this Shogunite quest. How are you? I don't think he does. I'm pretty sure I did all them all. Been well, let me give him some books right quick. Oh, actually, here you take this map. Ah. Ah. That panoramic photo actually, actually took to because of him. him, so I don't know why I didn't get. 
So sure to drop by again. one thing I noticed is like like this dude, right? You can see there's some things I can give him that he loves. I'm glad. And these were things that were part of a quest that he made me pick up, but somehow I still have. Like these things, this telescope and this blowfish uh, uh, fillet. Both of these things were things that were part of a quest that he he had. I'm, I'm already faded with him, so I can't even get no higher anyways. So there's no need even giving him no more gifts. It's a waste. Anybody you're faded with, it's, it's kind of a waste to give him a gift. Let me see. What is it? Just, bro, if you don't stop being an asshole to me. Friendly. I need I need to get your stuff up. Alright, let me see. We'll give him two of these. Oh. Very well. Till we meet again. I wish it told you who you did quest with and stuff too. I, I think I, I can do the travel back in time thing and do quests, and I think I can unlock a bunch of stuff that do way. I know you. Don't tell me. I'm the Ronin from the military academy. Yep. You'd think so. But my name is better known than are my features. <laughs> Thankfully, I don't stick out too much. At any rate, I have been looking for a capable fighter like you. Moreover, someone without ties to the Shogunate. You see, it seems that some of my retainers have become involved in shady dealings with a merchant. It was I who disclosed the matter. The same thing happened in Yokohama, remember? I figured that there was something rotten in the state of Edo. At any rate, our friend here should be able to put your man in line. <laughs> Which is why I'd like to procure some irrefutable evidence. With this camera. Got it? What a fine idea! Hey, you still have the camera I gave you? Of course I do. Exactly. That would be the natural thing. course of action, I'm told. But I have no intention of hiding behind my title or my castle walls. Besides, I try not to leave to others what I can do myself. Well, will you help me procure the evidence I need? I'm afraid that calling on a servant would only complicate matters sorely. I need to cook dinner here pretty soon. I'll do it after this video. Good. We'll head out when the I don't know how I'm even title this video. Place. I guess I'm gonna try to title it with all three of the titles, all three of the, uh, the quests or whatever, and see if it pops up and lets me do that way. Let's go, brother. The Shogunate is big and it's unwieldy. Yo, Even I cannot deal with corrupt officials as I please, and I'm the Shogun. Yoshinobu. I hear the scoundrels have gone from milling and bribes to selling four, arms four, and four characters, Yoshinobu. Whoever that may be. That's why we need to secure proof. But to be clear, this is not an assassination. This is where the transaction will take place. Let's slip in undetected. It's almost as if they weren't going to go right here. What? I don't want to interact with a checkpoint. I think I made a mistake to interact with a checkpoint. I, I've never interacted with one of those. Wait. Wait. Somebody just died. Oh, it's him. Of course it's him. Dear me. This... And this is terrible. Wait a minute, no. That looks like my teacher. I can't ignore this. But we must catch the killer. Is that my teacher? Oh. My god. I must be good. No, it's not. I can't let you live. Oh my gosh. Oh, 
Oh, I thought I reversed that. Oh boy, hit me with that freaking high up issue thing. You can tell it's a Team Ninja game, cause that's 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 some straight reused stuff. Your Excellency, are you hurt? You mustn't be so reckless. Oh, Your Excellency, is it? Seems we've hooked ourselves a big fish. Now this fool has made himself a target. How come you're here? And why are you screaming out his name like Master that? Master Katsu had us follow you at a distance. If only we had not lost sight of you. Worry not. I'm much obliged. That Katsu. Always one step ahead. I suppose I owe you my thanks as well. Yes, thanks to Takahashi's big mouth, calling out Your Excellency rather gave the game away. Uh, but what's done is done. Get some ninja to look into that old man, will you? I'd prefer to have seen those criminals tried. But I suppose the results would have been the same. Sorry to have troubled you. all the missions that's all of them <clears throat> cool so the next mission is still looking ahead but it's probably gonna change to something else obviously because looking ahead has been the title for a hot minute so it's probably gonna change to something else so oops, excuse me why can't i mark these uh, all right i'm gonna place these markers these are things i need to pick up later oh it's a firearm training and a horseback training yo i hate those Anywho, that's going to be it for this video. I appreciate y'all tagging along. We knocked out three side quests. And then on the next video, we'll knock out a main quest. So uh, if you can leave a like and subscribe and you're on YouTube, that would be great for your boy. A comment if you feel so inclined. Share with your friends so they can subscribe as well. So we can get up on this. And uh, I'll catch you in the next one.